Hi everyone, I'm Felix and I'm your host for today. We have our PA2 Transformers group on Sunday. So because today Kai Wen is absent, we have to take up like your friend's part if they are absent. You guys have to replace him or at least help him with some of the lines because the performance must go on smoothly and there must not be any dead air. If not. So Yong Liang, whose part do you want to take up? I think I can take the one part. Why do you think so? Because it's easy. Easy? But I thought it's quite hard. What is Yvonne going to talk about? Everybody rolls. Uh -huh. Like for example, what is your role? My role is the world legal club. And you will introduce everybody's role so that the examiner will know whose role is it, right? Yes. Yeah. And so next on Zichin. Whose part do you want to take up? Is it the same as Yongya? Yes, I want to be I want to take up Yvonne's part. I can describe why we are we have these roles for a reason better like Yang Ming. He has the narrator because he's very hyper and could make the story more alive and exciting and expressive. And for Yong Yang, because he's like a timid, tiny boy and very cute and his voice matches like the kind of baby noises, those kind of things. Baby noises, that's a very specific detail because you can give very detailed kind of description for each of the character, which is very important. He'll be talking about the props, right? Anybody? Anybody think they can do it? You? Young me? Yes. Why do you think so? Because it's easy to say it's like uh -huh. for the bench, we are supposed to make it as the bridge and for the grass, it's for the brick. For, for the, the goat to eat, the right? goat to eat. And the mask is for what role are we? Yeah, it's kind of Finger representation for your roles, right? Yes, and fingernails is for the trolls. I'm the narrator, I need to dress smart. Yeah, because and they, like and an MC. Yes, and, and the baby goats graph need to wear brown or white because they're goats. Yeah, because you can, when all of them dress the same, it's very much easier to see that they are three of the siblings. And when the trolls, where the two colored shirts, I think it's like black, it shows that they are the true siblings and it's very easy to differentiate who is who. And so for Yang Ming's part, he'll be interviewing people who thinks they can do it. He's such an interviewer. Me! Really? Yes, yeah. because I know when I'm talking, I know how to hold my mic and I know how to give it to like pointing at people when they are talking and when I want to talk, I know how to turn it back to myself ah, so and I know how to ask questions I'm like mm, So you'll be a good interviewer and maybe a podcast host like me So everyone, now we are going to go through our activity where each of you will kind of do a trial you will try out the parts that you want to do Solution, you want to do it right? We will start off with you. I will time it so you can't exit one minute. You will have to be less than one minute, okay? If you can, you should not look at it because you should know the part. Exactly. Okay? Look here, look at me. Look at me here. Oh. We will start in three, two, one. Woo! Hi. Hi, Hi Zemina. I'm Patience and now I'm going to talk about the introduce. Introduce about the theatre programs. Uh, in the program has two skills. Skill one is um, <coughs> a play or a drama which use the drama piece, the three video graph, and the skill two is movement to music because uh, <coughs> we use the songs. Uh, ima <coughs> we use the songs "Enemy" by Imagine Dragon, and <coughs> for the second half we have the <coughs> contributory skills. Um, we will be send the contributive skills of our background work and enjoy the show. Okay, there was 46 seconds. Now, Yvonne, it's your turn, right? A, a performance situation of two skills.
skills. And skills one is uh, a play or a drama. And we chose the title is the Tribilingual Drama. Skill and I will be the narrator. Skill two is about movement to music. And we choose the song is uh, Enemy by Imagine Dra Dragon. And uh, in the half, uh, second half, we will be uh, introduced about the contributory skills about our background work. And enjoy our show! Whoa! 53 seconds. 53! Who can beat Yvonne now? Well, take up Okay, yeah. All right! Yeah, please. Let's start in 3, 2, 1. Hi, I'm Jamila. I am Ong Yang Ming. And I am the MC for this show. And I'm going to introduce PA great school program for our group. A performance sequence of two performance skills. Skill one is is a play or a play or dra, drama. drama. Drama is the tribute good scrap and Skill 2 is movement to music. Movement to watch song we choose is uh, enemy. enemy. Enemy and the right, the artist's name is Imagine Dragons. Imagine Dragons. And the second and, half. And the second half I will I will be introducing We not I. We will be introducing our contributory, our, our contributory skills and our background work. Enjoy the show. I think he made it 115. No! 117. So now we have Yvonne's part. Who so can do it? Hello, examiner. I hope you enjoyed the show that we were acting on. And now I'm gonna talk about everyone's role. Yang Ming was the narrator because he's very hyper and makes the drama more exciting, expressive. And for the smallest video graph is Yong Liang. Say hi to the camera. He's the smallest video graph because he's tiny, timid, and very cute. And his voice is almost like a baby's voice so it's very good for him to become the smallest Billy Go Graph. Yes. For the second Billy Go Graph is Taiwan but uh, he's not here. But he's not here so we have Taiwan is the second Billy Go Graph because he's skinny like the story says and also very very smart. So like when in the dramas your Taiwan outsmarts the show siblings so he could get past to the grass on the other side. And for Zhu Jian Li, my role is the biggest baby girl graph because I am strong and brave. And for the troll siblings is Yvonne and Jimson because they are very big, scary and also they are really tall. Mm. Thank you. That was 1 minute and 54 seconds. What's up with it? Good! Yeah, it's about to be 2 minutes. It's about to be around 2 minutes. You did well. You gave a detailed description. You say 2 minutes is cool. Because it's a bit longer. So Yuna, let's start in 3, 2, 1. Hi, I'm the middle. I'm Yung Liang. Now I'm going to share. Now I'm going to share. Don't look at everybody's role. Yes. I am. I am the smaller baby girl graph because, because I'm timid and, and smart. Keep up with the time. And the coward is the second, second baby girl. Energy. Keep your voice up. Because he's very, he's very skinny and smart. Yeah. And Zhu Xian is the second, is the third. Yeah, because because he's strong. Yang Yang is a narrator. 
because it's very lively. Very lively. And, and, and he can speak clearly too. Yeah, the, Use your own word. And let the drama be alive. Okay. It was Go. one minute and about fifty seconds. Two, one. And now we are gonna end the show. But first, I'm gonna interview my friends about what they learned in the skill. Yang, what did you learn in the performance? <laughs> I learned clear speaking. <laughs> you want me to punch you or not? Liu <laughs> Yangming, what did you learn? I learned about the art and craft for the fingernails and I also helped them to do the trees. So Junsun, I heard that when when we started to do this, you were very scared to go on the bridge because you were scared to fall down. <laughs> yeah, and also I had learn how to uh, fight. fight. <laughs> no, I just I pretend to fight with uh, when the fighting scene and I learn some characterizations and how to perform my skill. And I learned about how to like make some actions and how and also art and craft because we also did a lot of things like the tree. He worked to like we work together to form a play. I hope that we will perform well in the next performance. Yay! Thank you all. We're gonna do a little reflection. Number one, what did you enjoy the most about the performance you have just given? I enjoyed about how I get to try other people's part, like Yang Ming part at the end, as a interview. About and then talking about about the thing and having a conversation to try other people's roles. Mm. And you get to learn new vocabularies too, not just remember your old, old words. So, uh, today we have know that others prefer what they are doing. This is more important. Why we have to know about other people's parts and roles? Yong Liang? Because when other people act on, then we need to help out. Yes. So what did you enjoy the most today? Playing ping pong. <laughs> Come on, what did you enjoy the most? And what I enjoy the most is the one minute challenge. Were you overtime, under time most of the time? Sometimes. What? Sometimes overtime? But not under time anymore now. You know why? You have more thing to say now because we brainstorm. See that Yang Ming, and then his outline is going down like that. One minute from there all the way down. So you don't need to write sentences. I think you can try. Just now you can talk quite well. I want to see if you can write this time. What seemed to be the most challenging part, Yvonne? What's the most challenging part? Limit, not time. Time limit. That is the most challenging. Okay. Now, do you know that to speak about one minute is quite hard? What is the most challenging Knowing part? Knowing how fast we can say in one minute. Is that the most challenging part for you? I think. I think no, for no. you is to remember the content. That right? was what I think. Okay. Yang Ming, come on. What is the most challenging part? Look here, talk first, then write later. What's the most challenging part? Remember what content we said. Yeah. Yeah. The most challenging part is to speak without the script, not for you. What is your most challenging part? 
walking with young men. <laughs> Second, what's the most difficult part? Working with Yang Ming. Why? I because he doesn't remember his lines. Why you're not remembering <laughs> your lines? And he keeps messing up so I have to scream at him. How you feel when your friends scream at you? Sad. <laughs> does, does that look sad? <laughs> you mean sad look like that? So you are happy to be scolded. Hey, nice. Oh, teacher, can you pass me the mic? Oh.